Hello, how's everybody doing? Uh, in reference to restraining orders against these people, my mother and father had restraining orders, and they were lifetime restraining orders against these people. These people need to go into court for their violations. And illegal satellite technology, or the fact of satellite technology, does have no legal right violating restraining orders. Meaning, your activity of using satellites is a violation of restraining orders and no contact orders. Do you understand that? In reference to the information of corporation restraining orders and gag orders on their government agents, every time they try to accuse my mother and father, or they try to accuse me of crimes, or they try to make up fabrications or hearsay of people meaning the activity of them accusing me to falsify investigations, that's a violation of hearsay. That's a violation of gag orders. That's a violation of them trying to rape me, stealing from me, and physically assaulting me with satellites and terrorizing my life and their activity of damaging my teeth, their activity of trying to steal sperm and blood, their activity of blocking me from my friends, is a violation of restraining orders against government. Such as government people trying to impersonate people. Government people trying to wear disguises is a violation of restraining orders. Their activity of disguising themselves, trying to get close to me to try to murder me, is a violation of restraining orders. It's a violation of no contact orders too. It's a violation of gag orders. Every time they have made up lies to accuse me with their misrepresentation of my identity and my family history and my biological parents and my birth records. This is very important that everybody knows these things. It has to be published in reference to the information of which people my mother and father had restraining orders on and which people and which satellite controllers had violated those restraining orders and the history of these dirty government people violating restraining orders with their falsifications of their people accusating against me, their people burning me and damaging my teeth, claiming they thought they were trying to find out information by damaging my beautiful teeth. Their people need to go into court no matter what. And the regulations and information about all the different types of restraining orders that there are against individuals that have tried to hurt me and people that have tried to steal my teeth, people that have tried to steal my identity, people that have tried to steal my penis, people that have tried to rape me, people that have tried to steal my blood, people that's been stealing my postal mail, is a violation of restraining orders. People stealing monies and checks and financial information is violations of restraining orders. Their activity of being in contact with things that I own, such as property keys, or information of properties or pictures of mansions that people have tried to send to me. Or in reference to cars, that in reference to car companies that may have tried to send me cars, these people had stolen those cars. That's Grand Theft Auto, too. That's a violation of restraining orders of them being in contact with property of things that I am the owner of, things that belong to me, things that belong to my parents. These people are in violation of restraining orders Look at the categories of every type of restraining order that there is against these people and their crimes of assaulting me and abusing me and their illegal spying and torturing me and burning me with satellites and their illegal physical contact in reference to their government agents trying to rape me, the government agents burning my teeth, the government agents stealing my blood, their people trying to steal my penis size, and their people trying to steal my friends are trying to steal my career in Hollywood or their people trying to steal my accomplishments. That is a violation of restraining orders too.